Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge will take over as Queen of England in decades to come, but preparations are already underway for the Duchess to step into the honourable role. Kate will take over as Queen when her husband, Prince William, is crowned King. However, the mother of three is already on her way to learning the ropes, taking part in several events in order to lay the groundwork for the important job. Kate's very first solo engagement with the Queen at King's College London was to prepare her for her when she is crowned Queen, a royal expert has said. Royal expert Rebecca Long told us weekly, Kate's been taking on new responsibilities little by little over the last few years, so it won't be a shock when the time comes. William and Kate are the favourite royals to take the crown in many generations, so the people of the UK are very excited about it. The Queen is determined to teach Kate the ins and outs of the prestigious role, so that she is fully prepared when the time comes. Another source told Us Weekly, she's really taken Kate under her wing. The two of them will often spend hours discussing royal life and the future of the monarchy. One source added, it's taken a long time for Kate to get to where she is today. But she's ready. Meanwhile, Prince William has already taken big steps into his father's role as Prince of Wales, and is already preparing for his role as King. William is already preparing to acquire his father's £1 billion estate, the Duchy of Cornwall, according to the Daily Star Online. According to the court circular, William attended two top-secret meetings in January in relation to matters concerning the duchy, the highest number of such meetings he has attended so far. Charlie Proctor, editor of Royal Central, previously told Daily Star Online, just like Prince Charles is preparing to become king, William is already preparing to become Prince of Wales ready for the duties and responsibilities he will have to take on. As an example, William recently left his job as an air ambulance pilot to become a full-time working royal. As time goes on his presence becomes ever more important meaning he has to commit all of his working time to royal duties. Kate and her sister-in-law, Meghan Markle were rumoured to be in a long-standing feud, with rising tensions between the Cambridges and Sussexes. However, one royal expert thinks the feud is nothing but speculation. Royal expert Katie Nichol told Glamour earlier this month, I think this idea of there being a catfight between the two duchesses has made tantalizing headlines, but I don't believe that. I've never heard from my sources that there has ever been a feud or a falling out. Referring to Meghan and Kate's alleged dispute over Princess Charlotte's dress fitting for her royal wedding, Ems Nichol said, I had heard about an upset over the dress fitting for Princess Charlotte. And I had heard that while Harry was very keen for the two of them to become best friends, there was never that sort of a friendship. I know in the early days Kate invited Meghan over to apartment 1A for tea. Obviously, she took her on that high-profile trip to Wimbledon, so they have spent time together. But what I think hasn't happened is, they haven't become best friends out of all of it. That's not to say they hate each other. I don't believe that to be the case at all. 